Gilbert tried a new activity with his students yesterday and shared the plans with his colleagues. They predict how Gilbert's students did and share the reasons for their predictions. They ask lots of questions to understand the task, the students, and their own points of view. Now, when they look at the student work, they can filter their opinions from their observations. Everyone in the group uses discussion strategies to broaden or focus the scope of conversation. They don't worry about coming to an agreement on a single position. They explore the differences and look to understand the possibilities. Challenging and pointed questions are seen as curiosity. Creative tension, they understand, leads to rich conversation and great problem solving. Now they finally name the problem and use multiple sources of data to verify the need for action. They explore the possible root causes, then identify the one or two that have the greatest impact. An action plan is made that describes the who's, what's, and when's. The implementation strategy also includes more data collection to test how well the plan is working. Next time they meet, everyone brings new data and starts the process again. This habit of inquiry makes them more reflective and improves both practice and student learning.